Santa's here with his little big bag of, you know what? I think I can pass myself as a Kardashian, I'm not gonna lie. What's up guys, my name's Angel. Welcome back to my channel. Today we are gonna do a really spontaneous unboxing today. I know winter is almost over. I know, I get it. But I have to do this crazy unboxing and it's all in here. Moon boots! I think I have four outfits I'm gonna be trying on and I cannot wait, so let's get straight to it. This is like an unboxing try-on thing, but it's not really unboxing because I kind of just opened it. So this is the color that I got. My sister got the cream white one and I remember I posted a TikTok on these try-ons and it literally went viral. We're kind of bringing it back. You know, the trend is kind of coming back. I think I remember people roasting my sister's um, cream one looking like a cast. So I kind of wanted to try to see if I could pull off these bad boys because yeah, I got the black one just because honestly it matches with just about anything when it's like neutral colored So I had to try and get my own first outfit that I ended up doing it was paired up with the skims Boyfriend kind of briefs as well as the matching skims tank top and mind you I am an extra small on like both of these the skim set itself for the loungewear is super comfortable It's so flattering makes you look like you have Big hips, big butt. I think it's perfect with the Ritzia TNA puffer jacket. I got this a while back ago and the gloss, it's insane. I am in love with it. Obviously black and white goes along with every single thing. And obviously you can add any accessories you want, like headgear. I think this one was really, really cute. Um, it really matched the style um, as well. This outfit is absolutely crazy. What the heck? Personally, I would probably wear this out maybe to go to like a friend's house to chillax and go to the grocery store if that makes sense. But in terms of going out, out, um, maybe not because you're gonna freeze your mother freaking ass off. I'm gonna be linking all of my outfits, by the way, down below in my description for my like to know it next outfit. This is kind of like a mini romper jumpsuit kind of a thing that I got from Opali um, just last fall. And the material on it is like really soft, not gonna lie. I think I got like a size zero from this one in all black. I'm not complaining, you guys. These outfits are so cute. And look at this jacket too. Are we not fangirling here? Like, tell me you wouldn't wear this. Tell me, like, come on. Jacket, I got this one in the double XS at Motel Rocks. Like I said, I'm linking everything down below in my description under my like to know it. It's really baggy, such a vintage boyfriend oversized style. And I just think it looks perfect with the short romper jumpsuit in general, just because it's like kind of the same length, you know, where the jacket ends. And I am just so obsessed. Designer bags is kind of like a little tiny bonus finish. I I mean, if you want to be more stylish and more, you know, hip looking, then I, you know, you can't go wrong with black bags. You can wear this out probably, like doing your errands, out and about, going to hang out with friends. I just think that it's just honestly the most adorable thing ever. Okay, the next one is kind of cute because I paired it up with just regular um, Lululemon leggings and the material of it looks like it could be a jumpsuit, but it's not. It's not one of those like buttery soft material ones. It's a little different, but I haven't worn these in a while. And I paired it up with the Babaton TNA Aritzia Crop. The cutest part about this, in my opinion, is the leg warmers, just because like I kind of had cream ones laying around. I have gray ones too, so either or would have looked great, but it's just the fact that it added a little bit more detail to the entire outfit in general. And then I had my Zara extra small puffer jacket that I've had for like, I think three, four years, not even kidding. This goes along with everything. It's super warm. Yeah, like I said, you can't really go wrong with any crop puffer with this outfit. I don't know, it just makes you look like your torso is a little bit shorter at the same time. I don't know if you know what I'm talking about. This outfit is incredibly warm. I could wear it out anywhere, like literally anywhere. Maybe not to the club though, okay? Not to the bars, not to the club. Okay, and in terms of like going to the bar, okay? And it's cold. Let's say you're going to Whistler, Canada or something like that. I'm just throwing out ideas. I have this really cute Rick's Black Knight dress and it's super tight, form-fitted, kind of just plain, kind of like a racer um, dress. And it's really nice because you could just kind of unzip it like this. And I got my Prada Sunnies, like I said, to pair it up with. And these are pretty expensive, but I think I kind of like already broke a part of it. What do we think about these Sunnies? Be honest. They're cute. 
I like it, but then like where would I actually wear it? To the bar? But then what jacket would I wear it with? Probably a trench coat. That's what I'm thinking of. Probably a black long trench coat that you can wear with this. And it looks fine to me, honestly. Okay, so I think that literally wraps up every single thing that I have to show you about them. The moon boots, I mean, these are pretty comfortable as is. They're really spacious. I walked around New York City the whole day with these on. No blisters whatsoever. You just wear some really comfy socks. It kind of just looks like just styrofoam in there. I don't even know, but it's really spacious. I have bunions. If you don't know what that is, maybe look it up or maybe don't if you're kind of like, what the hell? Let's just say it's genetically passed down, okay? Like I said, I will link down every single detail of my outfit on my like to know it down below. Let me know which outfit was your favorite because I am dying to know if we have the same taste in outfits. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, comment down below, and don't forget to turn that post notification. That way, you know, I'm always posting that entire week. And we'll see you guys in the next YouTube video. Bye! But does she really wanna fuck a stand to see me walk out?